Go YouTube, it's boy Mighty back with another one, you feel me? And today we are here back on the channel once again. Eh. All right, I got energy right now, I'm sorry. I'm feeling, I'm a good mood. Today's a special day. Today's a special day, it's a change for our channel, all right? I am 21 now, all right? Your boy turned 21 back in October 19th, 2021, you feel me? I've been 21 for a good four, five, six, seven months, feel me? I've been, you feel me? I've been to the, I've been to the liquor store a couple times, you feel me? I'm not even gonna show y'all just yet. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be doing another reaction. Hey, what the fuck? I know, I know, reacting to stand-up comedy. What is this? Look, you know I gotta spice it up, feel me? This is, look at the robe, look at the bonnet, hold up. We gonna be adding in, remember me 21? Yeah. <laughs> all right, calm down, look, look. All right, so I had an idea, right? I had an idea. Put this down. Put this down. Put this down. Every time we cringe, every time you laugh, every time a facial expression is changed, take a damn sip. <laughs> you see where we're going here? <laughs> yeah. It's about to get what? Real quick. I'm too excited, y'all. <laughs> Sorry, it's because I've just uploaded my last video. And it did good well, it did pretty well for like the first couple minutes and I was very excited. I like, I love it. You see what it does? You see what it does to me? I love it. I love the energy. I love the energy. Y'all do it to me, I'm doing it to you. Pause. What? I don't. Let's get started. <laughs> Let's get the drink counter. I'm a lightweight by the way. I only weigh like 160 and I just ate barely. So uh, it's gonna get pretty messy. Let's go. Look my uncle. Appreciate y'all. Oh, you saw the. All right. First of all, I gotta stop and give honor to God because without him, I would not be here Praise today. Praise him. Yes, Lord. I'm gonna let y'all know. I've been working out like every day for like you know a few years, and you know I was asking for you know man, I want a chest. I want a nice chest so I can walk around. You know what I'm saying? Girls touch on her chest and look good. That's what I'm Word. praying for. Big tip. A nice chest. Turned 38 today. So, all right. Thank you. I appreciate that. But it ain't all good though, because I'm standing in the mirror and I find myself checking for lumps. You know what I'm saying? Gr growing some breasts, okay? Just put it that way, growing some. And my daughter ain't no, ain't no help. She turned 16. This little heifer gonna bring me her training bra. I'm here, daddy. You gonna need that. So I went on and put it on, you know. Had to go on and put it on. But you Why know, you when you're going on? through some stuff and you're asking God for Why? some stuff, you know. Why did you put it on? I can't smile. Or, or laugh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> give me a second. But <laughs> I'm crying. <laughs> but. together <laughs> you did not have to put it on so he he i would just <laughs> okay ah. oh oh this is gonna be a long night let's go parents what they used to do though when they were little kids right when you were little kids you used to be, do, do bad things remember when your parents used to do right my mom would be like i'm gonna get the fucking belt right and when we were kids we were always rebels right we always said we always like i always tried to mock my mother i'm like i'm gonna get the fucking belt and right you said what? We said, we always like, I always tried to mock my mother. I'm like, I'm gonna get the fucking belt. That shot right there in my house, right there, done. My mom don't even beat me, and I would have got shot. Hey, gay. Hey. No, seriously. <laughs> um, so you can't understand gay people? No, I don't. Uh, I don't. I seriously don't. Because uh, what makes you like? Let's say for a gay guy, what makes you say, "Oh, I just want to suck a cock"? Seriously, what makes you? Yeah. Oh, huh? Oh, yeah. I like to suck cock. What? I like to <laughs> Where did this just go to? <laughs> what the fuck just happened? What just happened? How did you just go from... Whoa. 
How did it just go from me getting beat as a child to sucking cock? Like, not even dick, just cock. Dumbass, that's it. Blonde dumbass. Just saying, thank you for reminding me. I met a girl one time, and I asked her what her name was, and she said dolphin. Okay. She said dolphin. <laughs> Wait, you said I met a girl? Look at my fucking bicep. You think I can't meet a girl? <laughs> yeah. Look at my arms. Snack that smiles back. Body. I need to take a sip of that. I'm sorry. That was bad. Joke. Oh. Let's go. Oh my god, that's dangerous, isn't it? <laughs> um, for the radio, I'm, I'm walking into a thing. <laughs> um, hello. When I chose my topic, I was under extreme stress. So I am here to talk about why shoes are overrated. Yes, an essential thing that we all need. Mm, great. Um, Did she just shit herself? Mm, great. Um, but no, seriously, by the end of this, you're probably going to be throwing your shoes into the Thames. You'll be so convinced by my argument. Don't do that, guys. That would be really weird. Also, really inconsiderate to all of the animals that live in the oh river. God, they don't want your shoes or Who's mom? Animals. It's a joke. Um, uh, also, imagine now when you go and buy your jelly deals. We all buy jelly deals from the river, right? What the hell? It will be served in a wet. Uh, I'm just joking. Uh, we broke up before that. <laughs> and now I have to move all of my shoes out of his flat. <laughs> and that is mostly why I chose shoes. Why do I have so many shoes? I like I, it's crazy because I know people like this like the the same way they say jokes like what like that aggressive like I don't know it's giving it's giving it's giving mad adrenaline stims like Batman just fucking your fucking octane just fucking stabbing yourself over and over with a fucking adrenaline pin and that's where you just, <laughs> like why is she breathing like that bro <laughs> that's the first thing I hear. <laughs> Look, if shoes didn't exist, you wouldn't have this stereotype of women being obsessed with shoes, right? And sexism wouldn't exist. Because of shoes. I don't know if this is like stand-up comedy anymore, or if this is just like trying to trigger me. Mr. Struan Sutherland, everybody. Woo! <laughs> Even the intro was awkward. Who the fuck is on stage? Dirk? Oh, see, you already fucked up once you have notes. If you ever see a comedian bring out notes, it's already done for. Straight face mode, let's go. Fortune cookies. I would write one that said, your hospitality towards an unexpected guest will bring you untold riches. Then the person who got the fortune would drive home and find me sitting on their doorstep and they would invite me in for a glass of hot cider, ask me if I needed a place to stay the night, and offer to take me out the next morning to buy pants that were long enough for me, which would be good because it turns out that writing fortune cookies does not really pay a living wage. <laughs> the look up from the paper. Did they laugh? Like, yo. To a barbecue at somebody else's house without telling them. Then when everybody shows up and there's no food, you can say, oh, well I have a whole bunch of raw meat in my trunk, is that helpful? Then you become a hero, but you also maintain an air of mystery, which will intrigue the ladies. Because everybody will think, why does that guy carry around so much raw meat in his trunk? And you can say to them, I can tell you, but then I would have to grind you up and put you in my trunk. <laughs> and everybody will laugh at your joke, but some people will surreptitiously throw the rest of their burger over the back fence, which, which works out well because you didn't bring enough for everybody to have seconds. <laughs> They're not bad jokes though. It's just that they just have no context and no order. It's just like, this is, okay, one joke and then another joke. I'm not critiquing it. Give me this damn bottle. Give me this damn bottle. I'm not feeling good enough for this shit. Oh man. Dear Lord. Does he look at the camera every time he finishes a joke too? Is that what he's looking at? <laughs> I used 
still like wearing. I can't shirt. take this. I, I can't take this. Oh, okay, it's starting to feel me a little bit. <laughs> it's starting to feel me. It, it's starting to feel me a little bit. All right, now look, 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 look. I don't know, cause it's 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 weird, bro. Cause I was expecting it to be like a lot different than what it is right now, bro. <laughs> this is a cool set. Hello. Oh shit. You guys wanna hear a Tim Allen impression? Yes. My boy, what are you wearing though? I don't know, bro. He's either watching the football game at Hawaii or he just laid the craziest pipe down ever. Oh. <laughs> sorry about that. <clears throat> I'm really sorry. Hey, what kind of water do you guys drink? You guys drink from the city water or you guys drink from the well, I'm gonna stop pausing. I'm gonna stop pausing. I'm gonna stop pausing. I, I just have to get my mind together. Let's. Sorry about that. <clears throat> I'm really sorry. Hey, what kind of water do you guys drink? You guys drink from the city water or you guys drink from the the well water? Sorry. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what are you guys into? You guys like uh, jazz? You guys, uh, Jazz fanatics. That was crowd work. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, so I was walking down the street the other day and I looked through a window. Did you ever look through a window and see someone you don't want to see on the other, on the other side? I'm sorry. God damn it. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. So you ever look through the the, the the glass? And I'm sorry. I'm gonna reiterate this joke. <laughs> you guys didn't laugh. Generally, I'm sorry. Uh, did you see someone on the other side of the mirror? That not the mirror. It's the win. It's the window. It's the window that you look through. You ever see someone you didn't want to see it? I'm 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 a I'm a soldier. First of all, your hat has none of the colors that your shirt and your shorts do. You got your toes out. You have your toes out. The thing about me, I could be bad with the jokes, feel me? But I could just edit so I can put something comedic behind it, so at least y'all can understand the comedic. Um, 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 sense of humor that I'm trying to get at. I'm funnier than this, and I'm not funny. Like, I don't know, I feel like I could do something right now that's funnier than all the jokes. Ready? All right, I got you, I got you right now, I got you right now. Look, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm, I'm, <laughs> all right, wait, wait, wait. Wait, let me get my back. Please, no! Y'all notice the Bacardi, has got it. All right, all right, come on, we're not talking about that. All right. So, so, I go into a bar, right? I'm 21 now. I go into a bar. I'm 21. You know, I just turned my birthday. I'm 21. I go into a bar, right? I go into a bar. I go into a bar. I'm 21, all right? So, I walk in, right? Right? And I'm looking for drinks. I'm looking for drinks. I'm broke. I'm college. I'm a, I'm a college student, so I'm broke. I look on the shelf. I'm looking for the cheapest drink on there because I'm broke. I'm college student. So I'm looking in, and I see all these things on the wall. I, just, I saw all these drinks. I don't know what the fuck is this. I'm looking, I'm looking, and, and and I come across this slut. <laughs> so I've done this for ten years. And it worked for 10 years, but this one night is the night I'm going to realize, ah, oh, every other audience was wrong, and you're right. Maybe I'm not funny right now, but I don't think you're the one who's going to derail this. I moved fucking 3,000 miles, gave up my life, toured the fucking Europe for four years, and for some reason right now, you think you're not funny, fuck off. Well, maybe 
you should accept this isn't the easiest fucking gig in the world. I'm in a fucking corridor. Or maybe you should just... So you moved across the globe. Uh, what made you think that moving across the globe was gonna make you, like, funny? Like, Europeans just think shit's funny or something? I'm gonna continue. Thank you guys in the back. I'm in a fucking corridor. Oh. The lights are on. Everyone's here at work parties. It's hard. I'm trying. You don't like it? You fuck off. I'm fucking trying, lady. Stop swearing. It's comedy. If you wanted a clean comedy show, go to a clean comedy show. You don't get to dictate what happens. All right, the show will continue now. With less energy than before. Here's my best joke, which you might not like. Uh, my friend Sarah, she calls herself a feminist, but she misappropriates the word. She as soon as you said feminist, you lost. You lost. You can't win. They stay strong, yeah. You feel me? Like you feel you can't, you can't, bro. You can't. I'm taking another drink. This is not because I'm losing the challenge. This is not because of the rules. This is just because I need one at this point. Like literally, I'm taking mini shield. Hair recently, so I must be getting old. It's time to hang out at the bingo. First of all, we had to stop. Boy, look at your head. I'm sorry, you look like a Mr. Clean and Vandal uh Vandalmort, Vandal. I'm gonna stop the joke right there. Oh, this is bad. Good to me. So, uh, so they're taking pictures with me, and and others are uh, want me to give give them some kryptonite, and I go, sorry, man, I don't think aliens take drugs. <laughs> Staring. He's the type to look at you in your face and wait for you to like give you like a reaction or something so he can continue with the joke. He's not gonna stop smiling until he can until you smile back. Look, don't watch, think just aliens watch. take drugs. <laughs> Staring right at your shit. <laughs> I didn't laugh. Let me stop capping. Fuck, bro. It's already a little like it's starting like it's not. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm cool. I'm straight right now. Feel me? But I can feel it a little bit. You feel me? You know what I'm talking about? Oh, the gulps just keep on getting bigger. Pause. I need a little bit of water. Mm. No, I don't mix drinks. I'm a G. <clears throat> Uh, when people tell me to get off my high horse, I tell them that my horse doesn't do drugs. And then I gallop into the sunset. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm dating, this is what I hear. I want a man to look up to. Could you imagine me wanting something like that? Like going up to a pretty tall lady with a bow tie around my neck and saying, Hey, miss, I come with a free leash. <laughs> And then the smile afterwards. And it's just like, bro, what the? You just said the darkest joke in history. And that, that, bro, no, bro. It doesn't work like that. Why do you have wrinkles in your head? Is that how hard you smile? <laughs> do you smile hard enough to the point where you can get wrinkles in your head? Why did I just try it? By a round of applause, how many people here are dating? Wow, that's quite a few of you. Okay, it's a younger crowd. Wow. Um, I find dating really hard because girls like taller guys, but what they don't understand is that I have one of these. And I can't show it. I could probably go gay because guys don't care how tall you or how you look, and if that doesn't work, I can always become a monk. Um. Hey, miss, if you rub my head, I'll grant you three wishes. My cringe meter is filled to the top and it's spilling over. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. I can't even like, 
bro it's so like painful that it's like i can't even laugh at the fact that it's painful bro usually i'm like happy enough to the point where i can do that i can't do it right now bro i can't i can't can we stop this who's that did this was my idea this was my idea this was my idea. This is worse. This might be worse than editing. I might want to go edit right now, bro. I don't want to look at him any- Look at his face! Bro, he's giving me the death stare of smiles, bro. This is a sinister Mr. Clean. And that's not to make- This is not to laugh at him. This is not to, like, you feel me? Because we don't condone in any type of that. You feel me? We are all positivity and love and smiles over here. We will accept him into our community because he is a funny guy. But- Bro, honestly, I was having a great day. I was having a great day. And then I get to hear. As an amateur comedian, I expect to get heckled because that's how you get better. But I never get heckled because you guys think I have cancer. <laughs> what the? And then a smile afterwards. Like, what, bro? Damn, I gotta take another drink. Fuck. Okay. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I drink this way too much.